Hey, what is going on everybody? It is Nolan or the Optimistic Gamer here and welcome back to another video where today we are going to be building one of these power um, power line towers. This was actually a request sent in by Dark Shadow 335 So thank you for that. Um, again, I always love getting requests from you guys. Um, it, it just gives me ideas of what to do. So this is not my design. Um, I'm just building this for the uh, convenience of you guys. So I'm going to be building this variation and if I have enough time I'll be building that one. I'll do that one in a later video maybe or maybe not. I will just see. All right. So let's get on with this. The materials you will need are stone, nether brick fence, um, mossy cobblestone walls, nether bricks, and I believe that's gray wool. So uh, you will need those. Um, texture pack link is down in the description below. Now to begin, we are going to start with our stone. We're going to place four of them. 11. I probably should have done the counting beforehand. 11 and 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 11. All right, perfect. So we're going to start off by placing four stone in a square. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, with 11 block gaps in between each one. Again, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and on the 12th, and this one is super easy. We just do that. There we go. All right, after you have done that, you want to take out your nether brick fence and place 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 high on each row. So 1, 2, 3, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine on each one. And I will be doing a lot of um, cutting out because this is going to get very repetitive. So let me do this real quick and I'll show you guys what it looks like once we're finished. All right. So once you finish that, we have this four stone, 11 placed in a square, 11 blocks apart from each other, 13 by 13, essentially with nether brick fence on top that are all nine high. Next, go to the second one up, wreck it, and replace it with a mossy cobblestone wall. Just like that. And then, place it out, and up, and out, and up, out, up, out, up, and on the fifth one, just place it out. So, one, so this is one over and up one one two three four and then over let's do that again out up out up out up out up out so we have this one block gap in the middle and um on top of that um shoot i don't have optified if i did i could just use that zoom thing Okay, and that goes all the way around. All right, so now what you're going to do here is just basically place a row of the walls above that where we uh, just made that diagonal pattern. And this is going to go all the way around. So wreck the fence once you get it lined up with that. This is where we're at, and this is how it's going to look on each side. So let me do this real quick. All right, I've finished that, and next what you want to do is take out your um, take out your nether brick fence and place those um, right beneath the walls on the corner, just like that. And again here. And once again, right there. All right, let me check out what to do next real quick.
Okay, I also missed this. Those fence, they also go above on the corners as well. Just like that. Sorry about that. And then, it looks like... Hang on one sec. So here's what we're going to do next. On top of those fences that we just placed, put walls on top of each of those. And then we are going to do... We're going to do the uh, same pattern as we have done before. Although this time it's easier because A, we could either line it up with that, or B, just go... I hadn't thought of this before. Just go until we um, are one block out. And remember, from here, start by going out. It's not this and then up and then out. It's this, out, up. Just like that. We actually have four of them. So one, two, three, four. One, two, three, and four. All right, this is getting a little repetitive, so I'm going to skip ahead. All right, next what you want to do is you're going to make this inverted L shape just like that. And we're going to do that on all four sides. And then after we have done that, we go to that inner corner and we build that up by nine more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So 10 in total, including this one. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Let me do this a couple more times real quick. Okay, now we're going to do the same thing as we did before. Oops, we missed something. And then on the other ones right here, place 4, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, just like that. Let me do that real quick. Okay, there we go. Now we're going to do the same thing as we did before and place that row of walls going, well this one doesn't go all the way around, once you get to the fence, wreck it and then just place a wall. So it's the uh, fourth one up, so there's one fence on top of it after you wreck it, oops. Um, just like that, so again, on top of those uh, diagonal patterns, we have that row of walls and then it goes into the fence. So once again, just like that, wreck the fence, bring it out. All right, let me do this real quick. Okay, and once you have done that, now things are gonna get a little more complicated. JK, a lot more complicated. Okay, so we're going to this top corner and we're going to make a full cross, just like that. I hope that makes sense. So again, we have this sticking up. Right here we have this corner. On the inside, make that whole thing a cross, just like that. Then, hang on one sec. Okay, and then on top of those that we just placed, place 10 more fences. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And again, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Just like that. I'm going to do that a few more times, and then um, it should get simpler from here. So let me do that real quick. All right, we are making really good progress with this. What we want to do next is... We are going to do the same thing yet again that we have been doing before with the walls and building that diagonal. Although this time, instead of being from the outside, we're moving in one. So wreck that second block, I believe. Yes. Wreck the uh, second fence up on the inside that we have placed. Just like that. And that's where our first wall is going to be, and then extend it out, and up, and out, and up. Oops. And this one actually does meet in the middle, and connects like that. So let me pause there for a second, and you know what, let me actually scoop back and pause. It's not really going to help you with the fences, but it might with the walls. 
All right, I'm going to do that three more times, and we're actually almost done. All right, I have finished that, and it looks like we are yet again placing a row of walls on top of that. So let's do that real quick, same as we've been doing. This is, and do wreck that fence, the first one, not the second one. And then wreck that single one. And then right there, and boom, just like that. So don't mess up. All right, I'm just going to finish this. All right, making really good progress on this. Let me make sure we're lined up. Nice. All right, are we doing it again? It looks like we are. Although this time we do three and then go in. All right, simple enough. Wait. Oh, one, hang on. All right. Um, so next, go into the inner corner of those walls we just placed, and place a fence there. It's floating, but it doesn't really matter. And then bring it up by 11 more. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. I'm going to do that three more times. Nice. All right. And then we're going to do the same thing with the walls again one block above that next row so right there wreck that and wreck that make sense let me back up a little bit so you guys can see where i wrecked and then we're going to build it out up out up out and in by one block let's do that here so we place that one and then out up out up out in just like that alright so we have three rows just like that and then on the third one that block the wall goes in alright I'm gonna do that real quick alright now we're gonna do that row thing yet again so this it hasn't changed at all with um, just going in um one two three four five let me check and see if we wreck a block four five six seven no we do not but we do place fence beneath it so put put a fence there and right there beneath the rows and right here lining up with the walls basically add fences on the corners and then on top of that, you can start the row of walls just like that. There we go. All right, this is more complicated than I thought it would be, but hey, we're almost done. All right, let's finish this up. Next, we're going to take out our nether brick fences and on top of those walls on the insides just like that place six tall so one two three four five six line it up with those fences that we already have nice and easy all right let me do that real quick all right i believe that's gonna wrap things up for the fences fortunately and then we have a few more wall patterns that we need to do real quick and then that'll be that. And besides that part, of course. Alright, so what we're going to do is on this middle block in that row, place one, two, three, four. And then on the sides of it, one block up. And then one, two, three, four. Same thing on this side. One, two, three, four. And then I believe we go out, up, and out again. So you have to wreck that top fence. Out, up, and out. All right, one, uh, um, I'll show you guys one more time. One, two, three, four in the middle. One block up. One, two, three, four. So it's sticking up one. One, two, three, four on this side. Out one, up one, out one. Out one, up, out. All right, let me do that two more times. All right, I have finished that now. So what we are going to do is we are going to move on to this bit. And this is made out of nether bricks as well as 
um, gray wool and some fences not very many fences just a few so what we do is we place um, three nether bricks on each corner uh, on the fences on every corner three high just like that now this next step all depends on the way you want to face it if you want it to face this way and have the cables run through like that then um, face you know what face the direction that you want the cables to run I'll just put it like that next what you want to do is go out diagonally and then two just like that and then two more diagonally and then two more diagonally and two more diagonally oh nope two more diagonally <laughs> and three diagonally one two three and oh shoot I messed myself up I mean that does go there but okay and then next to that previous two dot you know what wreck the three we don't need three why is it always raining good grief and then um, do a two diagonal in just like that let me pause for a second and then we're just gonna mirror it on all sides so two 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 and in just like that I'm gonna do the same thing on this side real quick all right I've mirrored that they kind of look like a uh, crab pinchers if I'm gonna be honest all right next we place a giant row of a lot of blocks let me count this real quick 13 all right so what you do is on top of the two that's on the outside place another block on top of that on all four of the outside ones and from the side of that extend it out by 13 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 same thing here and we can just line it up there we go and let's fly to the other side and do the same thing 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 line it up okay so um, once you finished that we have these two rows of just the um, stone or nether brick rather sticking out we're gonna connect them in the middle just like this so we fill in in between the rows that we just made nothing to it just like that next what we're gonna want to do is go to where we have these like claw shapes I said they look like crab pinchers and go to the outside ones and then kind of diagonally up from them place two more just like that let me do that again so right here on the outside one the one that's like on that side place two more diagonally from that and let's do it over here and right here perfect and then it looks like we have three four three so go up and out diagonally and then place two more so we have three just like that and then down diagonally one two three four down diagonally again one two three so you should have two blocks open right there next actually I'm gonna go ahead and do this real quick okay next what you want to do is directly above the inner two right here place a block on all four of those I mean it's kind of hard to explain but I'll just show you just like that and then block on top of those inner sets of diagonals just like that and then extend it out diagonally towards the part we just built by one on each side there we go and once you have done that 
place a row. Let me count this real quick. So put a block on top of that one now. Extend it this way by one. And then extend it this way by four. So one, two, three, four. On top of that, towards that structure we built. And then in one, two, three, four. Again, one, two, three, four. And that one. And on top of this, one, two, three, four. And that one. Now we're going to go down diagonally from that row we just placed and fill in the entire middle section with the nether brick. Just like that. All right, we're almost done. Now all we need to do is put a block. All right, so you're going to have to just follow me on this. So we have this structure. What you do is you're going to go here, basically, and then place a block on the outside right there, diagonally from that gap right there on top of the three that we have placed. And then extend it over that gap. And then on top of the one we already placed, place another out and up again. Let me do that one more time because that may have been a little confusing. We're going to go here where we have this gap and then we have this row of three on this one, on the inside one, place a block on top, extend it over that gap and then go back to the previous spot, up on that first block, out and up. All right, I'm going to do that two more times. All right, now that I've done that, we only have one final step left, and that is to fill in where the wires hang from. I'm not really sure exactly what it's called, but that's what we're doing. So, uh, uh, two, two, two. All right, so the first thing you want to do is beneath, we, so we have three big sections on each one of these things. We have this one, this one and this one. All of these are going to have fences on the third block in on the underside. So again, one, two on the third block. Do it again. One, two, third block. One, two, third block. And then I'm just going to do that a few more times. And that is where the, uh, I'm not really sure what it's called, where the wires hang from. All right, and now all we're doing is just building this down in a diagonal formation until it meets up in the middle. So it starts out from the fence post and then it just goes down. This is going to get very repetitive and super simple, so I'm going to do this off camera and then maybe add a little more structure in there if we need to. Okay, I have finished that, and I don't think it needs anything else to it, except maybe another row of walls. I was thinking one more around here. I don't know. Let me, let me do this real quick and see how it looks, because it might actually work, but I just want to make sure it does. Yeah, there we go. So if you want, you can add that square in. Now, I do believe the video is getting uh, somewhat long. But you know what? We can go ahead and do this one anyway. It's just going to be a lot of repetitiveness. So let me count this real quick. And then we can get started on it. Okay, so I have just finished counting all of that. And this is the part that's going to get very repetitive. So the first thing you want to do is, I believe this is nether brick. Yes, it is. The first thing you want, what the heck? I'm not sure what this is. Whatever. So the first thing you want to do, I'm actually going to build it in line with this because that'd be kind of cool 
is make a three by three on the ground with your nether brick. And uh, let me give you a, some advice. Don't fill in the middle um, if you want to save time. So the first thing you want to do is build this 19 tall. So we've placed that first row. Now we do it 18 more times. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. I'm going to fill this all in now. So let me do that real quick. Again, this is very repetitive. So I'm going to be cutting a lot. All right, once you've filled that in, you want to make a cross shape now out of the nether brick and build this up 38. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, and you get the idea all the way to 38. So I'm going to do that real quick and fill it all in. All right, and I have just completed that. Next, take your mossy cobblestone walls and on the corners of the cross we just built, build those up 19 tall. So one, two, three, four, you get the idea. Let me do that real quick. All right, we are almost done. Next, go to the very top and in the middle, place a core thing, a tower, five blocks tall with nether brick, four, five. And then on the uh, edges, place four cobblestone walls, mossy cobblestone walls, on each, um, like, uh, surrounding that pillar. Okay, put a nether brick fence on top, and then take a, um, a red stained glass pane, and put it in the middle, just like that. Nice, let's go ahead and add in the, um, things that the wires connect to so let me count this real quick so here's what you do you go down to your walls and then you count up six above them so one two three four five six on the sixth place the uh, tower piece the first one and then count six more one two three four five five six on the opposite side do the same thing I'm just using those as markers and then go to the opposite side again at the very top and place another one so now that we have that we extend these out one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven so we're gonna extend them out ten more 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And last one, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So 11 in total. One block in on the underside, place fences, fence posts, like we have done in the past with the other one. Although this time it's just one block in, not two. And then we're going to do the exact same thing with the gray wool, where we build it down until it meets in the middle to form that upside down triangle with all those diagonals, just like that. I'm going to do these last two, and then we can wrap up the video. All right, that is going to wrap up the video, everybody. If you did enjoy it and you do want to see more just like this in the future, um, please let me know in the comments. I've been getting tons of requests from you guys. I am loving it. You guys are the best fans, subscribers I could ever ask for. So thank you for sending me all of these requests. Um, it, it truly does mean a lot. It, me it shows me that you guys actually care and you want to see more happening with the channel so thank you guys for that um you know what i just got an idea how would it look if we did that you know what i honestly don't know let me look up a picture real quick to see what these things look like 
All right, I re wasn't really sure. I didn't find any. I wasn't able to find any that looked exactly like this. So I'll just stick with this. I mean, you e feel free to edit it however you want. You guys know that. All right, let me get the thumbnail real quick. How do I want to do this? Like that. Ooh, there we go. Or maybe like that. Or maybe I could get that other one in the background. Hmm. You know what? I, it, the main eye appeal area is right in the middle. The tower part. So I'm going to take a picture of that. Nice. Got it. Um, so comment, rate, and subscribe. Check out the description. I just have a bunch of random stuff down there that... I mean kind of important you can contact me at contact optimistic gamer at gmail.com my website is optimistic gamer .com. my twitter is at optimistic gmr um, the texture pack link will also be down in the description and is the HTT texture pack I did not design these builds uh, some of them I designed those down there those four trucks I'm proud of um, but this one I did not design credits go to a server that's like Esterlon and um, check out my Lego channel Lego knowledge I'll have a link for that in the description as well and I will also have some affiliate links for my equipment that you can also check out I feel like I'm missing something but just check out the description in case I am because it's kind of important keep the request coming guys um, I'm getting a ton right now don't think it's overwhelming me I'm absolutely loving this um, you guys are loving it and that's that's really what matters so comment rate and subscribe and I will see you guys in the next video and don't forget to stay optimistic see you guys